Namaste guys, Rajesh here for Namaste Tech and in this video, I am going to do a speed test and multitasking comparison between the OnePlus 3 and the Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge. Before I start though, let me give you a quick overview of the specifications of both handsets. The OnePlus 3 is powered by a Snapdragon 820 chipset that is clocked at 2.2GHz. It also packs in an Adreno 530 GPU, 64GB of speedy UFS 2.0 storage and a staggering 6GB of LPDDR4 RAM. As for the Galaxy S7 Edge, it is powered by an Octa-Core Exynos 8890 chipset that features Samsung's own custom M1 cores that can run as high as up to 2.3 GHz. There is also a Mali T880 MP12 GPU and 4 GB of LPDDR4 RAM. Lastly, the handset also features UFS 2.0 based 32 GB of storage and the microSD card slot. So the OnePlus 3 should perform better than the Galaxy S7 in our multitasking comparison because not only it packs an additional 2 GB of RAM but it also runs a lighter version of Android that is free of bloatware. So let's put the phone through an automated speed test in which I'll be opening these applications and games. And after that, we will test their RAM management in our multitasking comparison. So I'll start the speed test with the Galaxy S7 Edge. As you can see, I have no applications running in the background. So 3, 2, 1, go. And done. So the Galaxy S7 Edge performed very impressively in my opinion and it loaded asphalted very fast. Now let's have a look at how the OnePlus 3 performs. So 3, 2, 1, go. And done. So the OnePlus 3 took 56.5 seconds to load all the 8 applications. This is almost 7 seconds slower than the Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge. And this is despite the Snapdragon 820 chipset performing almost the same as the Exynos 8890 chipset found inside the Galaxy S7 Edge. In fact, the OnePlus 3 should have performed better because it runs on a lighter skin of Android compared to the Galaxy S7. Anyways, now the time for our multitasking comparison in which I'll be opening these 8 applications on both phones to test their RAM management. I'll open all the applications first and then follow it up with the games. So as you could see, all the applications were present in the RAM of both phones. Now time to load the games and see how the phones perform. I'll open Temple Run 2 first, then follow it up with Skyforce Reloaded and lastly open Asphalt 8. So the Galaxy S7 Edge managed to keep all the applications and games in its memory while the OnePlus 3, despite coming with 6GB of RAM, had to unload Asphalt 8. This is because of the aggressive RAM management feature of the handset which OnePlus has intentionally done so as to make sure that the handset's battery life is not affected. If the somewhat aggressive RAM management of the OnePlus 3 bothers you, there is a fix but it requires you to root your handset. This issue is also fixed in third-party rooms. 
So the Galaxy S7 Edge is a clear winner in our speed test and multitasking comparison versus the OnePlus 3. The OnePlus 3 ideally should have performed better in our multitasking comparison because it comes with 6 GB of RAM which is 2 gigs more than what the Galaxy S7 Edge does. But due to its aggressive memory management, it did not do so. If you want me to do a speed test comparison between the Redmi Note 3 and the OnePlus 3, make sure to drop in a comment below and let me know about it. Anyways guys, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching it. Do hit the like button below and subscribe to our channel if you have not already done so.